Hey everyone, today we're comparing three popular apps, GoodNotes, Notability, and Freeform to help you pick the best one for your needs. We'll explain each app and then we'll see what they're best for. Let's dive in. First up, we've got GoodNotes. It's a note-taking app great for handwriting and drawing with tools to turn your scribbles into neat text or shapes. It works on iPads, iPhones, Android, Windows, and even on the web, so it's super flexible. You can organize notes in folders, annotate PDFs, and sync across devices. It's free for three notebooks, and there's a paid version for more features. Next up, we've got Notability. This one's just for Apple devices, so iPad, iPhone, and Mac. It's awesome for note-taking too, with handwriting and drawing, plus a cool feature. It records audio and syncs it to your notes, perfect for lectures or meetings. You can also mark up PDFs, it's free with limits, or you can get a subscription for everything. Last up, we've got Freeform. This is Apple's free app for creative stuff. It's available on iPad, iPhone, and Mac. It's like a big digital whiteboard where you can add text, sketches, pics, or links. It's great for brainstorming with others in real time, but it's not really built for regular note-taking. So, how do they stack up? GoodNotes and Notability are top for note-taking. GoodNotes is best if you want to use it on a lot of devices, while Notability shines for Apple users who love audio notes. Freeform isn't about notes. It's free and perfect for creative group projects. Cost-wise, Freeform's free, GoodNotes has a free basic version, and Notability's free with a paid upgrade. Pick GoodNotes for flexibility, Notability for audio, or Freeform for free collaboration. That's it, guys. GoodNotes for versatile notes, Notability for Apple audio fans, and Freeform for free teamwork. Which one's your favorite? Let me know in the comments below and subscribe for more tech tips. See you next time.